Root it. Yeah, it's what you just asked me. Yeah. Icebreaker. Okay, cool. Icebreaker. Boom. So look, I got a question for y'all, and y'all feel free to answer at home too. So there's like you know, everybody know the concept of heaven and hell, All right. right? And they say once you go to hell, you're gonna be tortured for the rest of your life and shit because you disobeyed God, right? Right. So my question to y'all is, you really think? The, the first nigga that disobeyed God about to torture y'all because you didn't listen to God? No. I'm not gonna say he was the first, because he wasn't the first. Well, he wasn't the first, but you know but, what I mean. He was his favorite though. But yeah, he was his favorite. Me? That's it, that's it. I don't know, I ain't, me, I got, I'm a sinner, so I, of course I'm gonna be like, nah, that, that's you, you. Enemy of my enemy, <laughs> right? It's my friend. My friend. That's, that's what I'm thinking. Right. Like, why am I gonna put it? Why are you gonna go me for him? Right. You don't even like that nigga. You don't even like this man. Yeah. But that's just. Well, feel free to talk to me about it. And like, that's speaking. That's, that's just speaking like. This is a question from from as as a man as an analyst talking about another man. This don't make sense to me. Don't look at me. I'm what? not answering that. You're not answering. What you mean? I just, oh, I, just, I, just don't, I just don't want you to go off the deep yeah. and be like, what? my religion. It's not, it's not like a. <laughs> I didn't even tell you what religion now. Nah, Thank you, cuz. I didn't tell y'all religion. Nah. I'm sorry, what's up, Jake? It's not about, it's not necessarily about what your religious status is. It's right. like at the end of the day, we wake up and sin. Like, we're just naturally born sinners. Like, mm -hmm. I'm not going to get deep into it, but. That's just what it is. Now, most people, they take advantage of the fact that, oh, sin is sin, I can always be forgiven, but that's not the case. Like, right. if you go out here and kill somebody tomorrow, and then you repent for it, and then next week you go do the same thing again, like, that's where the, that's where the real judgment comes in at. It's not just gonna be like, oh, you did this, mm -hmm. and now you just gonna rot in hell for this right. type of thing. So, so you think it hell that he gonna punish you because you did the same shit that right. he did? Disobey the, the word of God? I would, yeah. Okay. I mean, like, cause it's, it's logical. Cause why, like, why, I guess I wanna say like, why repeat it on purpose? Like, if you're sitting here repeating the sin, like purpose, it's a difference if, you actually doing it accidentally but purposeful, like I don't think that's what I'm asking. Okay, yeah. I'm asking, do you think the devil go punish you for disobeying God when he disobeyed God? So so basically like let's say all right, say you're, yeah, a, you're, you're a sinner right. on earth already, right? Right. Boom, you already sinned. Right. Hypothetically, you already sinned. Boom. You, right. 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 You, you you didn't kill people and killed again, right? right? And that's what the devil wants you to do. Right. So what he's saying is when you go to hell, you think that the devil's gonna punish you for doing what he wanted you to do? Can oh. can I say something? No. Up? No. Yeah, yeah, they never say the devil was gonna punish you. They didn't say you're gonna run in hell because the illusion is hell is hot. But right. they're gonna. But they also say you're gonna be tortured for the end of the day. I ain't never heard that horse. Yeah. Well, guess what? It's hot on Earth right now. What hot, motherfucker? And there is a theory that you know they always say. Root it. That's right.